very happy with today's result. Uh, as anyone who knows anything about hockey will know, uh, the Nashville Predators defeated the Pittsburgh Penguins, evening the series by a score of 4-1. to one. Um, I think it, it's awesome that uh, Nashville has been able to play well at home and, you know, really give their fan base um, something to be happy about. Uh, this is still going to be a very difficult series. Um, I don't know how well they're going to do when they get back to Pittsburgh, because obviously Game 5 will be in Pittsburgh. Um, it's something I uh, truly respect that um, the Predators have played very well against uh, the Penguins. The Penguins, uh, a lot of their players have already won a Stanley Cup. Uh, Sidney Crosby is supposedly uh, the best NHL player, um, although that's open to debate. Um, uh, Sidney got a good goal on the breakaway. Uh, it was very clever of him, and uh, he thought quickly, and he made the right move, and he uh, got a puck past Pecorene. Um, although that was uh, a bad defense on Nashville's part. Uh, I actually noticed that quite a bit in that game, that uh, there were a lot of times where the defense was um, a bit iffy, and uh, they took chances on trying to score goals, uh, which you, you got to do, you got to get pucks past the net. And, and they did do that, so in the end it, it has worked out for them. But there were some uh, close close calls. Um, if Pittsburgh wins this series, and they still could, if you think they're down now, right now, you'd be wrong. Uh, of course, it's not going the Penguins' way at the moment, but uh, this could change. Uh, I think this series is way better than uh, the San Jose Sharks last year. I mean, you knew San Jose wasn't going to beat Pittsburgh last year. But uh, it didn't look so good for Nashville up until Game 3. But now things are starting to add up. Uh, the fact that Pittsburgh won Game 1, but you know we're outplayed a lot of the time. Um, it's almost as if the tides have turned and it's in Nashville's favor. Sid the Yid has enough um, medals, uh, trophies, and Stanley Cups. Uh, on his mantle. If he's going to get this one, he's going to have to earn it. And um, I will not have any sympathy for the guy if he doesn't win it. Uh, I mean, that should be pretty obvious to any hockey fan. Um, I have heard that Pittsburgh Penguin fans are a particularly annoying bunch. Um, and I had heard um, that. Um, they don't take too kindly to tourists from other areas, especially from places like Nashville. Uh, personally, if the, the team I'm cheering for, which in this case is Nashville, uh, but ordinarily, if I could pick up all 30 teams, I obviously would want Vancouver to win the Stanley Cup. Whoever they played against, I would like that team. But a lot of people and a lot of teams don't have that mentality. I guess if it was a hard-fought, brutal series and a lot of bad things happened in it, particularly injury-wise and that sort of thing, and I guess insults or whatever else, they have a tendency to hate that team afterwards. Like Boston Bruins, they defeated the Vancouver Canucks in 2011, won the Stanley Cup, and then still had this big attitude problem. Um... Part of that might have been Aaron Rome hitting Nathan Horton, which probably contributed to his um, chronic injury, which has basically made him retired now, if he hasn't already. I'm, I forget what, what, what was going on there. Um, he'll never play again. Um, that might be part of the reason. It was an emotionally charged series, uh, as is this one. Um, but... Um, Whichever team wins, I think they should like the other team. 
Like if Pittsburgh defeats the Nashville Predators, I think um, they should go, well, we got to where we are because um, our opponent wasn't better than us. Um, I don't feel they should uh, have to, you know, win and then trash the team afterwards. Like go on a hate binge unless they have a good reason. And I don't see uh, a particularly good reason so far. I mean, Crosby uh, did give a big elbow uh, to a Nashville player earlier in the series. And there has been some questionable calls, but as of yet, there isn't anything too significant uh, for them to, to justify hating each other. Um, I'd really, really like to see Nashville win. I know I said that about Edmonton, and I have uh, wanted other teams to win, like I wanted Ottawa to defeat Pittsburgh. Didn't happen. Um... I could always flip flop. I do happen to have two Pittsburgh jerseys, um, not of Sidney Crosby, of Latang, and the other one doesn't have a name on it. Um, I'm not going to though. I'm not going to wear a Pittsburgh jersey no matter what for a good couple of months. Um, actually, kind of waiting for uh, to see what happens. I'm I'm very excited to see. Uh, Hopefully this maybe even goes to Game 7 and is a really action-packed series. It has the potential. Uh, anything could happen. And Pekka Rene, he did play a lot better today. And a lot of people were very critical of him. And as I said before, the goals he did let in, although they weren't super amazing, he could have stopped them, I suppose. But, you know, that sort of stuff happens. I've seen worse goals go in and cost series. Uh, for particular teams. So I think the critics of Pekka Rene are a bit harsh. Although it is clear that Pekka Rene has gotten older and he's not quite as good a goalie as he used to be. Uh, that tends to happen. Like uh, Marty Turco uh, was an elite goaltender at one point. Evgeny Nabokov was a good goaltender at one point. And then they aged and then they sort of just faded away. And um, this I feel is Pekka Rene. Uh, is his last chance really uh, to win a Stanley Cup um, because if Nashville does not win this series I can't see them making a repeat cup run next year or in the next few years and the next time they make a significant run it will be uh, comprised of a different set of players for the team um, I am excited and I am being very um, skeptical of uh, Nashville's success so far which is a bit harsh because you know I am a fan but uh, I do not want them to get the same mentality as the San Jose Sharks where they're just happy to get to the playoff final and then they choke um, remains to be seen um, you just you don't know what, what's going to happen here. Um, I think, um, yeah, Nashville Predators should tighten up on defense. They are a good defensive team. Uh, there were a couple of close calls. Uh, luckily, Pecorini was mostly there today. Um, yeah, like. Uh, it's funny, like, uh, you know, I'm in Vancouver, and uh, I'm rocking the uh, Nashville Predators jersey, and it's not a subtle jersey at all. This is a bright yellow, and I have a bright yellow hat over there. Um, you know, people can see me coming from a mile away, and uh, I have run into hockey fans here and there, and uh, I'm just surprised that hardly anyone actually says anything to me like uh, I don't know like um, I would feel compelled uh, to say something to uh, someone who I saw was wearing a uh, hockey jersey and I mean you don't necessarily have to be uh, like a strong fan of hockey to um, uh, you know feel the um, the um, excitement of a playoff series
But then again, you know, what do people like in the society? Um, you know, a lot of people are interested in things that are mundane and uninteresting. An organized sport can be a very, very exciting thing. And it's not all idiots that uh, like it. Although there are a lot of idiots that do like it. And uh, reciting stat uh, statistics of players does not make you an intelligent hockey fan. Um, anyway. Um, yeah. Um, well, I'm probably going to be at work in the next game. Actually, I wonder when is the next game. I'm just going to double check that. Because if it's Wednesday, then I uh, could watch it. Let's just check real quick. No, it isn't. It is Thursday, uh, June the 11th. Because today is the 8th, and it is Monday. The 9th will be Tuesday, the 10th will be Wednesday, and the 11th will be Thursday. And I'll be at work on Thursday, so... I'll be forced to uh, flip up and down on my phone to check up on uh, the current score. Um, yeah, I wonder what the hockey guy has to say about this. He's usually got uh, really in-depth, um, critical opinions about sort of stuff. Um, I did get this jersey before him. He's got a Shea Weber uh, yellow Nashville Predators jersey. He did get a Nashville Predators jersey before I did, uh, an earlier uh, version. Uh, but the yellow one, I, I beat him to the punch on that one. Uh, you know, he, he's way ahead of me in jerseys, but he's been collecting a lot longer than me. I, I am going to surpass that guy, uh, believe me. Um, well... Yeah, I guess uh, just um, cross our fingers and uh, hashtag anyone but Pittsburgh. Sidney Crosby does not need to hoist the cup again. Especially as I don't think he's as good as um, Patrick Kane or John of the Days. Well, he might actually be better than John of the Days, but... The Chicago Blackhawks are a better team than the Pittsburgh Penguins. But, uh, I don't know. Maybe they'll play each other in the finals one time uh, in the future. Who knows? Uh, we'll see. Anyway, talk to you guys later. Have a good